Good morning. Uh, I continue uh, my presentation on the subject of uh, STEM system optimization. This is the third presentation, and today we talk about the STEM thermodynamics. <coughs> uh, in order to uh, have a uh, deep understanding uh, about the STEM, uh, more uh, about the STEAM analysis. First, we have to start from the, the knowledge of the STEAM uh, uh, characteristic, which is uh, uh, it's better if we understand from the thermodynamic perspectives. <coughs> The thermodynamic is the science that <coughs> um, talk about the uh, the thermal uh, the energy yeah? the science of energy, uh, especially in uh, energy in uh, phase of the heat. So, the thermodynamics is the the way to uh, to understand, to, to have an understanding, deep understanding about the steam. <coughs> In thermodynamics uh, perspectives, um, water yeah, have a three condition. Yeah. We know that uh, steam is the phase uh, one of the water space. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we know that waters uh, exist in the several phase, yeah, several stage, several forms, <coughs> and in the thermodynamic uh, perspective, there are uh, three stages or three phases of the waters. The first stage is water in the subcool condition, which is water is in the form of liquid and its temperature is lower than the saturation temperature at the existing pressure. Yeah. Saturate the means the, 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 the condition that the, the water will uh, convert to other form, yeah. which is they in, in this state they will uh, change from they will convert from the liquid stage to become a paper stage. Uh, <clears throat> in this uh, situation, in this condition subcool, the energy content of subcool sub water is directly proportional to its temperatures because in this condition the pressure is constant. Yeah, because the pressure is, is constant in subcool condition, so the energy content uh, directly proportional to its temperatures. Yeah. With uh, the, the energy content increase with the increasing of the temperatures. And then the uh, second state is the saturated state. <coughs> saturated, as a soup cold water is heated, it reaches its saturation temperatures. This state is called saturated liquid or water, yeah. adding more heat, adding more heat leads to a change in its state from liquid to vapor without a change in temperatures. <clears throat> yeah. Without a change in temperatures, if we had more heat in this uh, condition, in the saturated condition, yeah, the water will uh, change uh, it states from liquid to vapor. This change of pace continues till it all become vapor. One hundred percent become vapor. So, uh, physically, uh, the waters uh, will change to vapor uh, state by step by steps. Yeah, step by step. Um, yeah. 
not uh, as an instance but in the step uh, uh, my steps yeah <coughs> uh, uh, part of per part yeah per part per part yeah. <coughs> the state is now called saturated paper or steam the energy content of saturated state is a function of temperatures or pressures yeah in saturated condition the energy content of the saturated state is a function of temperature or pressure yeah. and quality yeah, and quality quality is amount of paper in the two phase mixture because uh, the, the 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 converting of the water become uh, favor states uh, happen in the step per steps process so in this uh, state uh, uh, there will be a uh, two phase mixtures that is water and papers so uh, we we call this uh, the, the, the amount of the paper in the 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 the, the mixture called the quality called the quality which means if the quality is one or 100 percent it means that 100 uh, percent of uh, mixture have become 100 percent of paper uh, equality is 50 percent means there are 50 percent of paper and there are 50 percent of uh, liquid in the mixtures and then the, the the third one is superheated a further increase in heat input to saturated paper state yeah, leads to an increase in the steam temperature beyond the saturation point yeah. this is the superheated state of steam yeah, in this state the energy content of the superheated steam is proportional to both temperature and pressure Uh, some parameters of the subcool condition yeah. subcool condition some parameter of subcool condition we can see in this table yeah. here lies in this table some of uh, uh, important parameters such as temperatures uh, in degrees Celsius pressure in Pascal saturation paper pressure in Pascal, density in kilogram per meter cubic, specific enthalpy of liquid water in kilojoule per kilogram or kilocalorie per kilogram, and then specific heat in kilojoule per kilogram or kilocalorie per kilogram, and volume, volume heat capacity in kilojoule per meter cubic and the, the last one is uh, dynamic viscosity uh, in practice uh, we rarely use this uh, dynamic viscosity in uh, uh, boilers uh, conversation yeah in boiler discussion so uh, mostly we talk about the temperature pressure saturation paper pressure specific enthalpy this is uh uh, the four, the four uh, parameters that most we we, we, we will uh, uh, discuss later. <clears throat> so, if you look to uh, look at to this diagram, you can see that uh, the saturation temperatures is related to pressure. Saturation temperatures is uh, related to pressure. As you can see here, in the x-axis is the pressure. In the x-axis is pressure, which is this here, here is in uh, um, with the um, unit of bar. Yeah, unit of bar. As you can see in the in the atmospheric pressure, atmos atmospheric pressure. Um, or zero yeah zero uh, 
upon a, a zero a bar absolute yeah, zero bar absolute the saturation temperature is 100 percent uh, 100 degrees celsius so as we can we 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 know in the real life yeah, in the in in real life in the nat uh, in uh, 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 natural condition uh, we boiling what we boil if we boil water the the water will change or will boil uh, change to 100 percent of papers in uh, 100 degrees celsius because we boil water in um, atmospheric condition which is the pressure is uh, zero bar absolute or one bar uh, pre or on one uh, on one bar gauge yeah bar gauge uh, one bar gauge or zero bar absolute and then uh, the saturation temperature will increase with the increasing of the pressure for example if we uh, if the water have a, one, a pressure 100 uh, bar yeah the water with 100 bar pressure will have a saturation temperature about 310 yeah 310 degree celsius yeah. 310 degree celsius <clears throat> We, we can also uh, express these uh, parameters of the water and papers in a pH diagram, P pressure, H uh, enthalpy. Uh, pH diagram, uh, other name is Moyler diagram. Other, mo uh, other names of, of our popular names of this diagram is Moyler diagram, Moyler diagram, refer to the scientist name who construct this uh, diagram. Uh, okay but in this diagram uh, the axis axis the axis is entropy eh? and then the the y uh, axis in y axis enthalpy in x axis is entropy so this is uh, the each as yeah each as diagram each as diagram enthalpy entropy diagram the 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 red one yeah the red one is the saturated line if you look at this uh, diagram yeah this is the red line diagram this is the, the 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 saturated condition of the water and paper. Yeah, water and paper. The right side, the right side of the 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 the, the diagram is the uh, steam saturated, yeah, saturated steam, and then in the left side is the water uh, left side of diagram the the, the red line is uh, water saturated water saturated water if you look if you look this the, 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 the this you can uh, this is you can see that the point yeah uh, 0 0.2 0 0.4 0 0.5 0 0.6 0 0.9 and this is one this is the quality if I have mentioned in the previous slide, uh, the quality is the, the 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 amount of content of the uh, papers in the mixtures. Zero point nine means that ninety percent of the mixtures consists of paper. Uh, ninety ninety seven mean uh, there are in this condition there are seventy percent of papers in the mixtures. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Um, you can also uh, searching in the Google 
another kind of uh, diagram. You can find another diagram like like a Moyer diagram or uh, TS diagram diagram, yeah, or Fifi yeah, Fifi diagram, uh, pressure and volume diagram, yeah. Uh, so you can you can compare each of diagram, but uh, all of the diagram is consists of uh, uh, <coughs> all of the important parameters. Yeah, this diagram express all of the important parameters related to the uh, steam, uh, water steam condition. Yeah, water steam condition. <coughs> 